Hi guys, what's up? I am back with a brand new video and it's time to do a speed test comparison between the Samsung Galaxy A52 versus the Poco X3. And Poco X3, guys, you know that this phone has a Snapdragon 732G chipset with a 6GB of RAM, while the A52 has a Qualcomm Snapdragon 720G chipset with 8GB of RAM. And both phones has a quad cameras on the back. As you can see, we have a 64 megapixel main camera on both phones, but we have a optical image stabilization on the A52 as compared to no optical image stabilization on the POCO X3 so that's a really good thing on the A52 as well A52 also has IP67 water and dust resistance so without any wasting time let's get right into it both phones is competing off now let's quickly boot both of these phones up at the same time here we go logo it is here faster on the A52 followed by the POCO X3 and a52 it is running on android 11 while the poco x3 it is running on android 10 but we have miui version 12 as compared to samsung one ui 3.1 on my a52 and you can see still poco x3 faster when it comes to putting up beat the samsung galaxy a52 by a huge margin and a52 is take a lot of time and now the a52 it is also done about four or five second difference between these two devices in case you can see that and both phones has a very similar display but we have a full hd super amoled display on my a52 with 90 hertz refresh rate display while the poco x3 has a full hd ips l3 display but we have a 120 hertz refresh rate display on the poco x3 which makes everything more smoother than the samsung galaxy a52 and also both phones also has a punch hole on the center as you can see which is much smaller on the a52 as compared to the POCO X3. So now let's see the app's opening speed. Everything is closed up in the background. No app is running in the background. Now let's see phone dialer. That is just a tiny bit faster on the A52. Now let's see settings. And that is exactly the same. No difference there. And now let's check out some more application. Now let's start off with the Amazon shopping on both phones. And that is more faster and you can see exactly the same no difference there so now let's see the scrolling and feels more smoother on the poco x3 now let's see some games application now let's see candy crush saga let's see that how much a difference between snapdragon 720g versus snapdragon 732g samsung galaxy a52 faster there as you can see very interesting result and both phones also has dual speakers so that's really good as well now let's see the subwoofer on both phones and next game application a52 again faster there and okay just a turn faster not a huge difference this time in the subwoofer application but still a52 it is just a turn bit faster there now let's see the pinout on both phones next game application and that is exactly the same on both phones let's see temper and two last game application we have in the speed test and samsung galaxy a52 beat the poco x3 in every game application so that's really interesting as well a52 just a turn bit faster followed by the poco x3 as well now let's see the pubg mobile on both phones and we have a snapdragon 720g versus a snapdragon 732g both phones is perform very similar in the pubg mobile game as well but you can see that in game app or in time a52 is performed faster as you can see while the poco x3 is take a little bit more time and you can see exactly the same on both phones no difference there in the pubg mobile game as well now let's see spotify and that is little bit more faster on the poco x3 this time followed by the a52 let's see snapchat that is exactly the same on both phones and one thing it is also really good on the a52 when you go to the camera application and go to the right there and you can see and this is a mode which is called as fun and this mode give you a snapchat filters right in your camera application which means that and the snapchat video quality should be really good on this phone as compared to any other android phone so that's a really good thing on the a52 opening up the tutor that is slightly faster on the a52 zedge and that is more faster on the a52 followed by the poco x3 so now let's see the scrolling and face again more smoother on the poco x3 because of the 120 hertz 
refresh your display so last time i launched the cameras on both phones default camera app now let's see that who is going to be the fastest one and that is faster on the a52 followed by the poco x3 okay guys now let's see the internet browser speed i am using the first samsung internet browser on my a52 as compared to google chrome on the poco x3 wikipedia.org and that is definitely faster on the samsung galaxy a52 just a tiny bit faster there now let's see the scrolling and in the start i noticed some lags on both phones but after some time more smoother on the poco x3 so guys now let's see the ram management on both phones and poco x3 has a 6 gb of ram as compared to 8 gb of ram this time on the a52 let's see that who is performed better in the ram management phone dialer that is refresh let's see settings and that is seems like not refresh amazon shopping and that is definitely refresh on the poco x3 let's see candy crush saga refresh let's see subway surfer let's see pin out refresh let's see temper and two refresh and now let's see the pubg mobile game and you can see that is refresh on the poco x3 but not on the a52 a52 is performed really good in the ram management spotify same result let's see snapchat let's see the twitter that is not refresh zedge last way back to the internet browser where we left and you can see and guys over i have to say regarding the app's opening speed it is definitely more faster on my samsung galaxy a52 as you can see but not a huge difference between these two devices poco x3 is right behind to the a52 in game upload in time and the ram management is absolutely incredible on the samsung galaxy a52 as compared to the poco x3 so that's about it and thank you so much for watching this speed test comparison between the samsung galaxy a52 versus the poco x3 let me know your thoughts in the comment section below subscribe to my channel for daily tech videos and i will catch you in my next video peace out